Two passengers killed in a helicopter crash in the Whit Sundays this week have been identified as an American couple who were honeymooning on the trip of a lifetime. Two other passengers and the pilot survived the crash. Authorities are still trying to piece together what went wrong when the helicopter ditched near the Hardy Reef pontoon. 79-year-old John Pete Hansel and his 65-year-old wife Sue were living together in Hawaii and married in December last year. The couple were on their honeymoon in the Whit Sundays when they died after the helicopter crash near Hardy Reef Pontoon. The pair were also on holidays with Sue's daughter and her partner, who also survived the crash. The 35-year-old male pilot also avoided serious injury. Close friends have described the pair as soulmates who brought out the best in each other. Both were very active in a local community and charity club, with the group planning a vigil for the pair in the United States today. The Australian Transport and Safety Bureau will continue their investigations into the cause of the crash today and plan to interview as many eyewitnesses as possible. Investigators will spend the next few days working out if they need to refloat the helicopter or if evidence from eyewitnesses and accounts from those who survived the crash are enough to piece together what happened. There's also worries that refloating the helicopter could damage the marine park area where it sunk. The helicopter is currently 56 metres underwater. A preliminary report is expected to be delivered by April.